What's up, guys? Julian here, J. Lewis Trading. Um, here's another quick one. E.G. Oh, I just posted this on the Facebook page, uh, but this is for you guys out here on YouTube and uh, coming through the J. Lewis um, free trading video tab. This is, again, EGO. This is just a simple stock, simple trade, uh, simple setup. I've got the whole thing right here for you. You can see that this thing moved up uh, into the cash market, setting a $2.30 high, uh, pulled back and then consolidated in a uh, 230 to 223, 224 range. Uh, before price action started to work its way up uh, to the top portion of that range, sitting around that 230 mark. Volume started to pick up. I got very, very interested in this stock. Again, it was just a peripheral uh, chart that I had up. I had a whole bunch of things going on, a couple different trades in play. This was just something that I had on the sidelines. And I was really only watching it to see if that 230 level was going to get uh, approached on and then potentially broken out on. And uh, again, just watched it. This is one of the patterns that I trade. Um, Every single day if it comes up, and that is a ascending triangle. Um, you know, I'm, I'm more of a, uh, I've got more of a long bias these days, and I'm, I'm doing more of the breakout trades versus the breakdown trades. So I'm looking at symmetrical triangles, flat tops, ascending triangles. And when I see those, uh, based on my indicators uh, giving me the green light and watching some of the tape, uh, I just, I get into these stocks. I don't even... Think about it. Uh, I, when I get in, I manage the downside like I did here. I, I got in at 2.30 right at the breakout uh, as uh, volume started to ramp up. And uh, I started to see some shares getting uh, bought. I got in at 2.30. I had a 2.27 uh, stop. So it was super It was super tight. I had a three, uh, three cents uh, of downside on this thing. And uh, it just popped up here to about 2.44 uh, before it pulled back. A bit of a violent uh, pullback right through here. Uh, but the way that I managed risk, I was actually out of this thing at 241. Um, so again, in at 230, out at 241, 11 cent rip. This was this is my last trade. I had three trades in front of this, um, two move to profit. Um, and, uh, you know, it was a pretty decent day. So this was EGO. Um, the video, I'm going to do a full video lesson on this in the members area. So if you're a member and you're watching this, this is just preamble. Um, check into the uh, the members area. And I'll do a full video on uh, on where this came from, the scan that we used, and uh, exactly how we manage the risks on this. So if you have any questions, you know where I'm at. I'm at info at jlewistrading.com. And uh, you can check out the website and sign up for the free video library. Uh, we've got about 40 to 45 videos in there currently. Uh, they're very, very short trading lessons. And they're, they give you some insight as to what we're doing over here. Uh, on our desk. So again, this is EGO. This is one of the intraday trades. This is my last trade of the day. Uh, 11 cent scalp, nothing too crazy, but again, you're doing it on some okay size. Uh, you're going to make some decent cash on these. Um, I'm at info at jlewistrading.com. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video lesson.